Hi friends, my name is Charity Barton and today I'm going to be talking to you guys about how to stay fit like a cheerleader. So for those of you who do not know, I am a cheerleader for the University of Tulsa in Tulsa, Oklahoma, and I'm going to be showing you guys three workouts that you can do with a partner. So this is for whenever you guys are home. I know it's about to be Thanksgiving break and you're, there's going to be a lot of food and you guys are wanting to You guys are going to want to eat and, you know, maybe not go to the gym, make that trek out there. If you're going back home, you don't have the school gym close by. These are some great workouts that you can do at home and with anybody for a partner. So your friend, your um, hometown friend, your high school friend, your cousin, your mother, um, the hometown boyfriend maybe, I don't know. Here we go, let's get started. As you can see, I have changed and I'm ready to begin and Here's my friend, my partner. Let's get started. Assisted V-ups. With these, I will be explaining what you will be doing and what your partner should be doing. So first off, what you should be doing is grabbing your partner's legs and then bringing your legs down to whatever direction that she throws your legs to about a 30 degree or six inches. Do not touch the ground and then bring it back up. Make sure you're squeezing your core and using your arms to make sure that your back stays to the ground at all times. Watch here. Super simple, super easy. Make sure you're breathing too while you're doing these. Legs together, legs straight. As you can see, it's kind of hard. <laughs> now partner, this is the second time, you're gonna do a three set. So partner, make sure that you have strong legs and also that you are pushing the person's legs down um, pretty much in whatever direction that you want, right, left, or to the front. That's it y'all, assisted V-ups. Now this right here is a little bit difficult. You're gonna have to do three sit-ups and then stand up. One, two, three, up you go. <laughs> Just make sure you're keeping your abs. Look at how my legs are my legs are so close to my body. It helps you stand up. That's the key to this one. Do about five or three. Honestly, do however many you can do. And if you can't stand up all the way, you can, um, you know, move the feet. Instead of my partner, she's standing on them. You can just move your feet to be underneath the bed and stand up that way and use the sides of the bed or, or like use your partner to stand up. So for your partner, make sure you stand on the toes, giving all the weight that you can and don't grab. But my partner happened to grab me because she didn't want to fall. Um, also partners, you can sit down while standing but putting weight on their toes. That's it. These are really weird. I'm just gonna tell you that right now. So the, your partner's gonna be in a semi-plank and you are going to have your butt um, on the shoulder blades and your feet crossed underneath her. Make sure you scoot up. It's really important that you're up far enough, like close to the head, otherwise the sit-ups are awkward. And as you see here, mine are kind of awkward. Um, I didn't want to be too high up on her because I didn't, you know, I didn't want to hurt her, but it's really important that you are because they look kind of awkward. Um, so you are getting a workout as well as your partner. Partner, you're just on all fours. Super simple. Make sure you keep a straight back. And make sure you guys are, again, watching your um, core. Really squeeze it to pull up. And keep your legs off the ground like I should have been doing. <laughs> That's pretty much it. It's time to stretch. Okay, up and over. To the right, your left. Switch it up to the center. Make sure you're breathing. Feet together, let's do a pike. Butterfly, my favorite, I love this one. <laughs> it's so fun, yeah. Press down, nose to toes. You can go under, you can go over, whatever you'd like, just nose to toes. There it is, <laughs> right leg back. Let's make an L shape. Ooh, you can feel that. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Just so you can see what I'm doing. What are those called again? I don't know. You know what I'm talking about though. You know those. Everyone knows this stretch. Make sure you do your arms. Ooh, I'm cute. <laughs> Up and over. And switch sides. That's it. 